scientist describe each part of the leaf, you're ready to practice describing each part of the leaf all by yourself. Here's a few things to remember, and here's an example of how to do it. There are four parts of the leaf, and each part of the leaf has one or two different ways to describe it. We start with the blade, or the whole leaf, and we look at the box in the top left corner. Our first choice about the blade is the blade flat or needle-like. We make a choice between one of the two. Our next choice is also about the blade. Is it simple or compound? We choose one. Then you move to the margin. The margin can either be lobed or not lobed. Choose one of those two choices. Then move to the next box where it can either be a smooth margin or a tooth margin. Choose one of those. Then go to the box down below where you're looking at the tips of the lobes. If it has lobes, the tips will either be pointy or curved or spiky where they hurt. Choose one of those three and only make that choice if there's lobes. If there's no lobes, you can actually skip that choice. Then you move to the veins. The veins are either going to be pinnate, one straight as a pin, or palmate with lots of veins. And then last but not least, you're going to make the choice between a short, medium, or long petiole. Now that you know your choices, let's see an example of how another leaf lover makes the choices in describing the parts of the leaf. Describing the parts of this leaf. This leaf has a blade that's flat as a pancake. The petiole is attached to wood and there's only one blade attached to the petiole, so it's a simple blade, not compound. Flat, simple blade. Now let's look at the margin. The margin goes out, in, out, in, so the margin has lobes. The edges of the lobes look kind of curved to me, and they're certainly not sharp, so the edges are curved, but in between the lobes, it's very smooth. So the margin is lobed, curved tips of the lobes, and smooth. The veins, it has one primary vein stuck to the petiole, so the veins are pinnate, one straight as a pin vein, and last but not least, the petiole. The petiole is way shorter than half the blade. If I bent it over, it doesn't even go to the middle. So this has a short petiole. Flat, simple blade, margin lobes, smooth and curves, pinnate veins, short petiole. That's the description of this leaf.